Good morning, Arizona. Welcome back. We are here with Home Depot Debbie, and we're getting ready to finish off our craft project, making a cool little end table. Yeah, Scott. she is yeah. the queen of DIY <laughs> yes, projects, aren't you? Yes. How are you doing, Debbie? I'm doing all right. Great. How are you? Excellent. We're doing, uh, this is the National DIH, which is Do It Herself Project. Yes. And it's uh, the third Thursday of every month at all Home Depots, 6.30 p.m. Okay. You can come every month and make a different type of project. Actually, we give the workshop on how to do it, and then you can purchase the materials and make it at home. Okay. And so in the first segment, we talked about how to make the base. We cut our PVC mm -hmm. pipe and put our elbows together to make our legs like so, and then you're gonna take a two by two piece of three quarter inch plywood, or you might have some at home, and you're gonna cut it to size to fit the bottom of the crate, oh, okay. and that's gonna give it support. Okay. Then you're gonna take an inch hole saw, and that will attach to your drill, and cut four holes, and this is gonna hold our adapters that's gonna actually hold our legs. Okay. So after you drill your four holes, before you put your adapters in, you wanna pre-drill a couple holes because the wood will split if you just go and put the screws in there. Oh. So we're just putting some um, pre-drilled holes in all four corners, and you wanna do that before you put your adapters in. And then you're going to screw your adapters in and then put your legs on. But before you do that, you wanna put your um, screws in and secure the board to the crate, and that's what's gonna give it the stability. If you'd like, you can use the other piece of the board, because it's a two by two, and put it as a top. On the one we have here, I just left the crate as the top, okay. but you can actually reinforce oh, it with another piece of plywood if you want. And then you're just gonna put your screws in, and uh, Debbie's able to maintain a flawless manicure, even though she that. does all yeah. of this work. Yeah. It's what really do, impressive. When I do work, my nails go down. You know, I get that. Well, you can see in that crate I have an accessory, and it says Hollywood. And one of my coworkers <laughs> bought that for me because at work I walk around and everyone goes, "Hey Hollywood, hey Hollywood." And so when she saw that, and she's like, "I gotta that buy that for you." Debbie. <laughs> so then you're just gonna screw in the other adapters now. On this one, we just spray painted the whole thing okay. one color, but you can do whatever you want. You can make the base black and leave the crate natural. Mm -hmm. You can, you know, paint it different colors if it's going in a child's room. You can do so many different things um, with it. And I'm just going to secure one more of these with a screw, okay. Okay. and then go. we will put it all together. Let's see all that. right. No, you I want better not. <laughs> I want to see Olivia come in on Thursday night. She's got to learn to work with power tools. I know. Someday. <laughs> Add it to my list. <laughs> <laughs> so then you have your whole structure here. And Scott, if you hold those legs up right there. Whoa. This is going to go in. Come on, team. This is like a pit crew. 30 seconds <laughs> left. Show it. me a table. There all you right. go. And then the bottom one. We'll we push go. that in. There yes. you go. You have Debbie, your table. that's excellent. We'll Very see nice. you tomorrow night at Home Depot, Debbie. 30 Arrowhead Home Depot. There she is. Thanks uh, for being with us.